This is the main road north to Arba County in Sichuan province, where Tibetan exile groups say over the last few days there have been deadly clashes between Chinese security forces and monks and protesters, leaving more than 30 people dead, including women and children. There is no way to independently confirm those reports. In fact, local police there say the situation is calm, and in their words, everything is fine. But clearly, a troop buildup is underway. On the way here, we passed at least five military trucks. Three of them were carrying heavily armed soldiers, and the license plates on all those vehicles had been partially concealed to hide the identity of those units and where they were from. The reason for that, we just don't know. Also, according to Tibetan exile groups, earlier on Monday, hundreds of troops were flown in on helicopters to Arba County. Once again, we can't confirm that, but earlier we saw two military helicopters flying overhead. Now, the reason why we're using the night vision, the green image that you're seeing, is because we're trying to keep a low profile. To simply get this far, we had to pass through four police checkpoints. I was in this region uh, about a year ago. Uh, back then, there were no roadblocks. So, obviously, right now, the Chinese authorities are trying to control who gets in and who gets out. There's also a lot of speculation here. One rumor has it that as many as 100 ethnic Chinese have been killed by Tibetans. Also, that Tibetans are using dynamite to blow up Chinese-owned businesses and shops. These are just rumors, unsubstantiated rumors, but it is an indication of just how tense the mood is here right now. John Vores, CNN, Sichuan.